Good morning, everyone, and welcome to TransWest Truck Trailer RV. We're located in Frederick, Colorado. That's about a half an hour north of Denver. My name is Larry Vickers. To get a hold of me, simply call the office at 303-684-3404. Today, we're kind of stepping out of our comfort zone and taking a look at something a little bit different. You're used to seeing the Freightliners and the diesel pickups from me. Well, we're gonna look at something a little bit different today. This is a 2000 16 Chevy Silverado 1500. The truck has just a touch over 63,000 miles. So I realize that the truck market's coming back a little bit. There's starting to be a few half tons pop up around there. So we're going to talk about what makes this specific truck unique and why you should buy this one. Well, as we admire it from the side view, the biggest thing that jumps out at us is the color of this truck. I mean, that's one of Chevy's nicest colors in terms of it being the dark blue. So the color of it makes it unique. Plus, we talked about something already that's gonna make this truck unique when you compare it to others, and that's the mileage that it has on it. As stated, it has 63,000 miles. The national average for the amount of miles put on a vehicle per year is 20,000. So as you can see, this is well below the national average. So we have mileage, we have the color. Another advantage to this truck is it was owned by one of the techs here at TransWest and he took immaculate care of it. You know, we have the data to prove, you know, service records, things of that nature. So it was very well maintained before we ever got it. This truck, does have the Z71 off-road package. And basically what that allows us is to take it off-road and do some things without tearing it up. There are plates located underneath the truck to help protect it. So we're not gonna be punching holes and things, stuff like that. It's gonna be very well protected if we do go off-road. Now let's take a look directly in front of the vehicle. Tow hooks located here and here. Plus, we find sensors located right across the front. So if there's an item here or lower directly in front of us, we're gonna be able to note, we will be notified that that is there. We see a blacked out Chevy badge located right in the middle. LED headlights on each side. Now as we take a look under the hood, that's Chevy's 5.3 liter engine. It offers 355 horsepower. I have a Chevy with that engine in it and I like it a lot from the standpoint it's able to tow a little bit. Uh, we do the 4-H thing, you know, my family does with the kids, and we haul steers, things of that nature, tow it right behind, and basically have no problems at all. So you're gonna get an engine that's not only tough, it's able to tow quite a bit for a half-ton engine, but in addition to that, it's an engine that's gonna last a long time. As we look at the hood, what do we notice? There's actually have room in here. There's things to do, there's room to do things. I mean, right here is where we would put the oil in, for example, windshield washer fluid right here. So I like that from the standpoint, you can actually get in there and do some things yourself. Now, as we start to walk around, we see the Silverado badge located right here. As we take a look inside the driver's seat side, yet another advantage to this truck when you're shopping it, comparing it to others. Look at the color of the interior. It's not black. You know, that's a, that's a gray. And that's very hard to find anymore is vehicles that the interior isn't black. So there is yet another advantage to this specific truck. Trailer brake located here. 
The truck is four wheel drive, so we can turn that on right there. This is the lighting as well for the dash. We see floor mats located here, right here is the release to crawl under the hood. We can make adjustments to the seats located right here. As we take a look in the back seat, this seat does pop up for more storage. As you can see, it comes with an extra hitch for the bumper pull and some covers as well. Now, as we get around behind the truck, and again, we're gonna work from the ground up. We see the bumper pull, and this one has the hitch already installed. Here is where we hook up the lights. in addition to sensors running across the back. LTZ badge located here. Now the LTZ trim package is kind of in the middle. It's not the upper, it's not the lowest, it's kind of right there in the middle. Backup camera located here. And another blacked out Chevy badge located right there in the middle. As we let the tailgate down, we can see that the bed is already lined to help protect it for longevity. Tie downs on all four corners. Now, as we admire the truck from this side, let's talk about the engine in this truck. As stated, it comes with a 5.3 liter. Well, a little research has shown that that engine's been around since 2007. So as you can see, it's been around a while. All the kinks have been worked out. This truck is gonna last a very long time. A look inside the passenger seat. These seats are heated and vented. And once we crawl in, I'll show you where the buttons are for that. Two glove boxes, one here, one down here, and it comes with the original manual. It comes with the Bose surround sound, this, one of the speakers being right there. So let's crawl on in and take a closer look. So as you can see from the interior, I mentioned earlier that this truck was very well taken care of. There aren't any scratches, anything like that. This truck is six years old now and you would never guess it by taking a look inside. So as we work top to bottom, right here is the button for OnStar. Now that is still comes with a free 30 day subscription to OnStar. And basically that is navigation things of that nature. You can actually call it and say, give me directions to the nearest steakhouse, and it's gonna do that for you. Another advantage to OnStar is if you accidentally lock your keys in the vehicle, you can press that, give them the VIN number, and they can actually unlock your doors for you to get help you get in. So as we take a look at the screen, this is where the backup camera will be. In addition to that, one of the th things we're going to do for you when you purchase this truck is, is set up your phone and your Bluetooth. So once you're able, so once you drive away from the lot, you're going to have all of that set up and ready to go. There's a projection cruise located there. If that's something that you trust, you can use that there to help you as you're in your travels. It comes with navigation as well. 
as we come on down and take a look at the climate control basically dials on both sides to set whatever temperature that you want now there are a few buttons located across the bottom okay this one adjusts the pedals this is traction control located here this is the light that goes to the bed of the truck we have park assist located here so those sensors that we looked at this is what turns down those on and off hill descent located right there I mentioned that the front seats are both heated and vented so right here is the button for that you can have a three lights for high two for medium one for low and off and this is the same thing on the driver's side now as we take a look at the driver's side and take a look at the dash we're able to do some things from the steering wheel as well for example we can see the our trips a and b we can monitor our gas mileage and see how far we've gone 83 miles until empty right now as you can see we recently had the oil change so we still have 92 percent left this monitors our tire this shows the fuel economy and basically tells us what our truck is doing a timer if we need one this lets you know what the speed limit is when you're in your travels as well this shows you the engine hours transmission fluid temperature where our trailer brake is sent if we are off-road it notifies us of what's going on so as you can see there's a lot of information we can get just by pressing one specific button on the steering wheel this is tow assist so if we do have a trailer we're going to want to push that button because that'll make things smoother and safer in our travels while we're towing as we take a look at the console we can see a store little storage bins here in addition to chargers running right across the front you can actually charge your phone right here and as we open that up we can see just how far down that console goes to let us store items as well so very nice used half ton pickup we have on the lot this is stock number 5U220777. If you have any other questions about it, please give me a call at 970-370-4067. The work extension 303-684-3404. Feel free to email me at larry.vickers at transwest.com. Thanks for tuning in today.